going on YouTube? Sentest Collector here with another G.I. Joe Classified Series review, this time of Zorana. Got this one actually from Ollie's for five bucks. I've been waiting a while. Here's a UPC if you need it. I'm waiting a while to snag her on the cheap and finally got something decent at Ollie's. Closest Ollie's is about an hour away, so I happen to be in that area for something else. I decided to stop in there and got lucky per se. Still haven't gotten lucky at Ross yet. We got the insert and then the window packages are coming back with junk yard, mutt and junkyard. Here it is in the plastic. Let's go ahead and get it out. Okay, so here we go. Quick look as you know, Zorana, Zorana is Zartan's sister and also sister to Xandar. So here's the original 86 Zorana. So they kept the styling cues there very closely, even down to the little boots there. And then I guess oh yeah, they have the swappable hair here, which I think is probably more in tune or in touch with the original. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's say so. Let's look at the accessories real quick. So here's the original backpack. It's actually pretty similar to the new backpack, similar to the old one there. It's got a hole there. Take a look at the rest of these accessories. And then her original rifle or weapon. And then they did a nice little upgrade to the rifle. And then that one crazy like knife there. And she's got a dagger. And then a mag. The pistol. It's not sure what's going. This is going up here. And I guess you could stick that there. And then the dagger, I'm assuming, would go. Yeah, there we go. The dagger goes there. The headpiece doesn't seem very secure. It seems... A little big, I should say. There we go. Okay. Yeah, I'm digging her. She's a solid figure. Looking true to form to your original. Yeah, movement there in the feet. Uh, oh, there we go. Lower ankle movement. Double jointed knees. These knees seem really compared to some of the other figures. Got the upper leg movement here. And she's got good flexibility. And hands. And a slight hand movement. Double jointed knee, or just gonna be double jointed elbows. 
And he's got upper arm movement, even with the shoulder blade or shoulder pads in the way. She's got good arm movement here. Not really going to get any much up down because of these shoulder pads. Uh, she's got slight torso movement back forth, but nothing left right. Full head movement up down and around. I'm not sure which hair do I like better. This one has a little punk rocker look. And that one's kind of more true to form to the original, I guess. Uh, here's... Yeah, they took yeah, pretty much all the styling cues from the original, even though it was 80s. Modernized it, I guess, a little bit. But... Yeah, it took all the Time cues for sure from the original. Even, yeah. Even with the knife here. The inseams, the boots, even down to the spurs on the boots. And Lenny and team did a really good job. Even to, with these over the knees. That was a good job. They just made the face more updated. Put earrings. Mine didn't have earrings, but there was an earrings version as well. In the 86. Put a zipper here. Just put more details than the original. A little clasp there, even like the original. See subtle... Details. Yeah. That zipper all the way there. Belt. It added a chain on the new one here. Yeah, even the old one had a dagger. Yeah, the original 86 had a dagger right there, so they kept that true. And then the holes and the rips. They did a real good job of, if you're looking for something that was on point with Yara, this is it. And compared to DC Multiverse, when they were still making them 6-inch figures. I wish they still made these in 6-inch. Instead of all McFarlane with the big 7-inch figures. And the Female Steel Brigade. So yeah, Zarena. Definitely true to form Dreadnought. Zartan's sister. I guess she's definitely gonna be a solid addition. If you're into Dreadnoughts and want the full Dreadnought team for sure. But yeah, guys. Like, comment, subscribe. JJ out.